It would have been great, great for blue blood. There we go. Damn, got out of it. But yeah, I can't afford anything at the scavenger market. My thought too is that we could uh just bring down the unrest in this district and then get that like that was my first thought i can bring the unrest down here and then go and get this hollow scanner but i don't think i need two hollow scanners like that the only issue i think claymore exactly that's where is going to be the one who gets all right so oops welcome back to the channel i'm king of bad and in today and in today's video turn that back off we're back with XCOM Chimera Squad. Uh, I took the time, stepped away, looked up some videos and all that on how to uh, balance my microphone. And from what I can tell, it looks, it sounds pretty good. So the only thing that would be different now is if there's interference between my microphone and like the game volume that's coming through. If if that's if it's still an issue, I think that's what it is. Because I did a little test recording, which is really just me recording with nothing else playing, and it sounded pretty good to me. Like well, not even pretty good. It sounded perfectly fine to me. So then now i know if there's any issues past that it'll be because of like interference with the game sound as well but welcome back we continue on where i think we're getting through this fairly quickly i think it's what 15 days per investigation or something like that something like that i don't know can't remember for sure now the question comes in this is 125 where i can get the armor which is 200 this is going to benefit everybody so actually there's there's no there's no question about that if I got anything else, it wouldn't have made we sense. Gray Phoenix to a recent spate of We've already looked at all this. I stopped the game and shut everything down to look for it too. As you know, our presence in city. So we, but we did hear all this at the end of the last video. So this one gives us an expanded magazine, which I'm definitely gonna go for. I think. Plus, this one's unrest is gonna push up to two if we don't. Uh, I should probably pull that down now. Uh, I should put a field team on it first and then pull it down. The bottom row is security. confirm and then i can use this so to bring it down by two instead of just the one and i might as well go ahead and put this one on too right the finance one don't have enough intel i need 40 more intel for it okay C confirm yeah i don't know why i wouldn't let me just back out of that one but whatever so free field team if we get the free field team though it means we can put one here and then we'll be done there but i think i'm still gonna go for this expanded magazine because that's gonna help us out in combat overall and not just for the field teams which will increase how much stuff we get back overall too though uh strike mercenaries are present on this mission i think Ooh, didn't see that she had that blue blood is available and we're gonna make items available except we have no weapon mods you can get the extra padding the hollow scanner can also go to you same with the med kit pretty much just took everything that uh zephyr had and i'm trying to make sure again that my nothing is really peeking out get our friendly vip to the evac so far it's looking pretty good like when i talk my voice hits yellow in obs and the game sound comes up to about negative 30 db uh, enemies deal plus one damage during the breach first unit this entrance ha does three damage plus three damage during the breach i do believe blue blood has the best aim he also has the hollow scanner though but so does patchwork so we have her use her hollow scan and then claymore can uh bring up the rear actually no claymore can lead us in yeah claymore's gonna lead us in because he can do the most damage as long as he hits then we'll do blue blood using his hollow scanner and patrick using hers also i don't know if those are stack or not but we're gonna find out now because there's no negative to not using them Grenade out. plus both of these things will help increase the aim that uh that claymore has on whoever he decides to try and shoot at which i mean it's really pointless to shoot at them with claymore shot since it's doing so much more damage that's for that's okay i'm gonna go with the thing with the most health that we might actually hit these hollow skins didn't seem to do much overall for his aim but we're still able to take out that one uh trooper do land shot ignore armor and yeah land shot ignores the armor and the cover bonuses i think if i remember that correctly 
we might be able to take you out we did and we'll use the dazzle on you try and take that out i see the vip head for the evac now another possibility that we do have is to move shelter all the way to where the vip needs to be and then switch spots with the vip but i do believe in order to do that shelter not, not i keep calling him shelter his name is canopy canopy no what is his name i think it is shelter hang on a second i gotta check okay it is shelter shelter in order to do that would have to see uh the vip we're we gonna shoot at now what's number three looking like number three is real close to death who do you have the best shot on number five what about number four no, that's number seven on your second shot go for it now i went wide oh he does also have ap's huh so maybe i want to move you no if i move you there you'll be open there i'll put you are there any enemies over here doesn't look that's six four and two so i'm gonna put you right here that seems like the safest place for you to be right now considering everything else hopefully my mic isn't peeking out right now my talkback sounds the same as it did before but it just a sounds a little crackly how much Don't damage that did to you none anyways we use dead eye here gotcha. and then we'll use yeah the normal shot here three to four damage and you missed all this extra shit for you to hit and you still missed bracketing target almost got me chaining joe gonna hit both of them it will it's a solid five damage spread out right there yep And now number two is almost dead as well. Into position. What position are they getting into? This is weird. That's bullshit. I said a bomb off next to this car doesn't explode. This man shoots one bullet and the whole car goes up. Fucking restart the mission. I feel like I'm gonna lose a lot of these hostage missions, which is also why um I didn't friendly VIP didn't do the one where they start using hostages more because then they could just kill the hostage and the mission's over still some bullshit though i don't know how he's using one bullet to blow up an entire car we we set off a bomb exactly next to a vehicle and nothing happens to that car i got set on fire a second later but that still doesn't mean anything and all right uh we'll have password come second with this blue bud and then shelter Not valid at that breach Moving point. In. We're going to go for this one. Cool. Now it doesn't matter who we shoot. Go for the bruiser. Go for them. And you just dazzle to disorientate everyone else. Yeah, so we managed to disorientate all everyone who's left on the fields now. VIP is present. Get to the evac. All right, let's use shrapnel bomb. We can hit. Can we hit both of them? We can't. This bomb is gonna go off. I feel like we should put it like right. Let's put it right there. That way, if number nine decides to move around like he did last time, he'll be moving into the range of this explosive. Actually, number nine's not gonna go before this goes off. And then you can take a shot on. Let's take a shot on number three, yeah. So that means our turns are gonna come a lot earlier now. move you to right about here 
There's gonna be an explosion on number three and hunker down as well. Explosion on number three, the armor got shredded. Now we can use You can use subdue on them. Can we get the cover? Yeah, we can. So we use subdue on them right here. Puts us in cover and closer target. to where we need to go. Because we're trying to get to this top corner still, right? It looks like I'm taking them around and swinging them around back. I'm trying to keep them as far away from cars as I can right now, since it seems that they can combust in one shot. Got him. Do we have an angle on the other dude? We don't really. I need a better angle. Yeah, we'll put him right here. That way he has a better angle on them in case they do decide to move. And since he's in Overwatch, he'll be able to shoot them. We'll just move shelter over here. I'm going to try that thing that I was talking about where I switched the place. He did manage to hit them with his shot. They are working around the way. They're hunkered down and behind good cover. So yeah, I was going to say this shouldn't hit them. I have a 90% chance to hit right here. Go ahead and take them out. Dash them all the way to over here. I think, yeah. That does leave them all the way out in the open, though. So that, that's actually a problem. I shouldn't have done that one. Not the best move right there. How can we overwatch this area? Is that dash? I think I did just dash on accident. It was, yeah. Damn. Okay, all right. They're going to come in from that side and this side. We're more concerned about this side if they come in than we are the other way. Because this side is closest to where the actual VIP is and the VIP is left out in the open code. because of me. Don't burn through your ammo. I'll just have you overwatch this door. Running out of ammunition. Yep, that was the right thing to do. Ew, I see that rat run across the bottle. That armor's tough. That armor has a weak point. This is gonna go off before number five gets a turn. Shrapnel, out. Now I have to work on moving this slow dude all the way up. We'll put him right here for now. Nothing risky. Is this the VIP? Get them out of here. evac and then we're gonna work on moving claymore up so i'll probably use team up on claymore actually give him a dash uh not what i thought was gonna happen do remember this though go for a shot on them if we hit it means they'll die on their turn yep so now they're dead before they even get their turn and we can focus on moving in this entire round low on ammunition. god damn you move so slow This man is taking like five steps at a time. Headed this way. If they move, I'll shoot. We almost want to move. Almost want to move shelter really close and then teleport Claymore over. All right, they're super far away. I don't think they're gonna be able to do anything from there. Okay, you can take a shot on them. No, we use Chaining Jolt because we're trying to kill them. And we don't need to necessarily shoot them to kill. So we just use Chaining Jolt since it's 100% and they only have one health. It brings us back to Claymore's turn. And at this point, we can get everybody out all at once. So as long as this Viper, I believe it is, our Python doesn't pull anybody. Damn. Doesn't pull anybody, we should be fine to go. And I think that would still be out of range. 
Yeah, it's definitely out of range. The weapon's range is what saved us right there. Doesn't matter. But we could leave you there in Overwatch just in case. So we'll, make, we'll skip his turn and leave him there in Overwatch. Oops, wrong one. In turn. Okay, so now we're able to get everybody out because it put all of our turns back to back. That's always going to give us the opportunity to take blue, uh, blue blood out. I don't know what I was going to say. Bloodborne? I don't know. So we have now have the opportunity to take blue blood out whenever we want to because it's going to prompt us to do it at every turn. And then we can take Claymore out as well. Evac. I am low on ammunition. Claymore's out now too. So that was a pretty clean mission, I think. It only took one shot. It's from someone. I can't remember who. Oh shit, we were not harmed the whole time. The first one we did, we did, we only got shot once before uh, that car spontaneously combust in front of us. So. We used to call the place Shankville. It was outside the wall so Advent didn't care what went on. I'm glad the city council leveled the place and build something new. Don't know if I fancy if I'm fancy enough to live in Renova Heights, but I can't walk down the streets without someone killing me for my dental work. Definite improvement. Stay out of Bugtown, a local guide to City 31. So the unrest is down to zero there, lower to two in those two districts or in the stacks actually. So yeah, I would say we did pretty good there. We got the weapon mod that we went there for as well. Looking for lands of adventure? Or just something for the little ones? Come on down to the Thought Bubble. We're located three blocks from the square in City 31. Graphic novels from the old world and the new. Come see what everyone's thinking about. This dude is it, like the way he's talking is very creepy. It's like he has this hidden agenda. Uh, we're going to do warehouse fire because he's going to give us money and that's what we need the most of right now. The fire broke out at a city impound facility storing some rest restricted tech. If we respond immediately, we could help contain the blaze and salvage some valuable materials. Uh, three MPD links this to a string of similar fires. They believe this is an arson, so cover up a, to cover up a burglary. Ooh, wow. Assembly is completed. The monks here are worse than in training. We can fix the place up. I have some ideas. No hammocks. Never again. That was your own fault. That pipe wasn't load bearing. You said hang it anywhere. I am not having this conversation. So we finished that assembly. I don't know what I'm going to go for next. I'll decide that in the next video. And we forgot to get Zephyr into training before we uh, started that last mission because we took off the team as we were forming it instead of stepping back. Assembly idle. We checked this, this already. Okay. We don't we can't afford anything that i necessarily want from the scavenger market i would prefer if we got the advanced stock so we can always be doing two damage uh this extended advanced extended magazine though i still might pick up um but let me see what we got from that last one uh, i'm pushing all the wrong buttons armory blue Bud's definitely gonna get that um that magazine because his everything he does is about shooting so that's plus one to the clip i could get two go ahead and buy that other one um yeah, I think I might go ahead and get this other one, the advanced one, and give it to Blue Blood. Oh shit! Actually, there's no point in me doing anything because I'm finna end the video. Uh, so thanks for watching. Uh, that's XCOM Chimera Squad. Guys, thanks for watching. I'm King of Bad, and you can follow all my other stuff that I do in the description down below. Switch. I've been I was streaming most of the summer, although that sounded like complete dog shit of the uh i was using my headset for my xbox and was just streaming straight off of my xbox I had nothing set up to stream with but going forward i'm just gonna switch what i was streaming mostly was stardew i'm gonna switch that over to stardew i have a save on my computer which is gonna be like i don't know a month or two jump in the game or a season or two jump in the game no a season and a half pretty much but that'll be fine because you know the next season will roll around anyways but that's enough of me rambling on at the end of the video so i'll see you next time 
Uh, bye bye. Bye bye bye. Bye now.